first of all, I've seen the first three episodes. I yeah. thought they were fantastic. Uh, I can't wait to finish the season. Before we go go into that, mm -hmm. I just have to address one thing. Uh, you have a family member that was just cast as Catwoman. Mm -hmm. Have you guys already been joking around about being in the same universe, like both in DC and all that? We haven't been joking around about it. I think it's just more of just being super proud of her. I mean, she's so talented. and You know, Warner Brothers and DC been extremely good to me, and, and uh, I'm excited for her. You know what I mean? It's just, a, it's fun. And just my kid, or, you know, her, her, her brother and sister are going to be there and be in that whole world and just be able to watch her. And it's just a trip because I have my kids on Justice League and Aquaman. And um, it's going to be fun. She's going to be badass. It's so I'm, cool. It's great. Mm -hmm. I'm 100% sure. Like, she's going to kill it. She's, she's going to kill, kill it. it. Yeah. She's perfect, I, yeah. I loved the casting. Yeah. Well, now let's jump into why I get to talk to you guys today. Um, so one of the things about this is I was, there was a lot of talk when the show was first coming out that all the Apple shows were going to be like really PG and yeah. really safe and like whatever. And I watched the first three episodes. I'm like, oh no, this has some real shit in it. Yeah. Like, sorry that's for what my thought, language. That's what I thought when they hired me. I was like, are you sure you heard the right guy? Yeah, I know it kind of went back and forth a little bit there at one point. Yeah, no, yeah. they took it all the little... Mm. The watermelon move, mm. the, like, oh all those are just from the old noggin, and they kept them in. I, I, was, I was shocked. Listen, I watched episode three last night, and again, I'm going to pardon the language. There was a point in episode three where I said, holy shit. Yeah. Like, I, I was, yeah. I, I loved it. Um, so talk, talk a little bit about, actually, I don't want to make you guys talk about episode three. I want to talk about the world building, mm. because it is really, really so well done. It mm. feels fully developed and three-dimensional. Mm. Just like all the characters on screen, can you sort of talk about the, the world building of this show? Francis, Apple, I mean, all our producers, everyone yeah. killed it. Because, I mean, walking into it, we can't, I mean, we get hired, we come into it, and yeah. it's unbelievable. Because yeah. I think every department has to know about every department. They all have to link up to each other. Mm -hmm. You know, props need to know about weapons, the mm -hmm. weapons need to know about fights, the sets are involved with that. I mean, everyone had Costumes, to be completely in tune, because yeah. it all has to support the blind community, right? Mm -hmm. It all has to support the blind world, so. Yeah. Um, whew, everyone that was before us really coming in, it made yeah. our jobs a hell of a lot easier. Yeah. There was actors, a lot of support. But, I mean, then the support of us having a massive boot camp where I've never had experience that where it's like group acting therapy slash movement slash, you know, sleep shades and, and, yeah. and sense I think the show sensory be... workouts. You know, I mean it was just yeah. something we've never experienced before. Humbling because, you know, in my own egotistical process of like just dealing with this isn't my process to discovering, wow, this is really learning a lot, connecting on another level that I've never done with other cast members and that's there's just really moving. I'm, I'm at the pinnacle of where my career is, and never done work like that before. So. Yeah, it's um, it 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 means everything to you. I think I think the stuff that we did there in that in that month or so we had just to prep and all these exercises and moments we created. We were creating memories and stuff that you know sensory memories between like us and yeah. the family and stuff. And I think that's to be able to do that on a show, to be able to to be given the time and the people and the resources to do that is just amazing and uh, you know I think that's what you'll see that you feel that in the show I even think that our, it even wouldn't be with extras in the background like yeah the background we didn't, I didn't even hate saying extras because they were just in our world they yeah. were always constantly with us they're pretty much better than I was and it's was, it was I want to respectfully disagree on this well there's a lot of guys I mean dude Navid is unbelievable like, I know Navid he is, is unbelievable. like I know. double whip like we had to have whip masters and we just learned so many things but you're doing it with your Background. So I'm standing next to you know a part of our tribe that they're just they're not just walking around the space. We everyone has a job and it's it's just you, they, you're talking about world building. That's it. Yeah. We're, we had, we were building it with the whole community. Yeah. So. How much did you guys know when you, when you're doing a show like mm -hmm. this, which could run for multiple seasons? Mm -hmm. How much did you sort of ask where is this all going to go, or you know what I mean, like or, or how much yeah. you sort of like just trusting in Stephen Knight and Francis Lawrence? Yeah. Well, we had to do a lot of trusting. Um, I mean, I definitely did. Um, yeah, we knew certain things, and then certain thing cha things changed. Um, yeah, I don't know how what to say about that, really, because it's, you know, without going into yeah, anything. I, I, I definitely don't want to know spoilers. No, 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 of course but not. But, like, you know, like, you want to hope that you have a multi-season arc, or, like, you know... Yeah, definitely knew that. I definitely knew that getting yeah. into it. Yeah, we, we knew where it was going, and yeah. when I talked to Stephen Knight, I was extremely excited. That phone call was, hands down, one of the best phone calls I've ever yeah. had. Because he just gave all the spoilers of where we're going and what the whole world's going to be. And so knowing that, 
knowing what I know and you don't know is yeah. amazing. And, and just to go into his mind, this was so full of like, it's just amazing. So that sure. was great. One of the things that I took away from your character in this is that the, your character has a lot of heart and it's very three-dimensional. It's not just some badass. And yeah. did that like appeal, I mean that had to appeal yeah. to you as why you wanted to do it. Yeah. I just think there's a lot of things I've done in my career that may mimic or look like this because of the, you know, covered in fur with a bunch of blades, fighting, battle scenes, and i just never been able to do the whole father aspect of it and the sensitivity that you get with playing Baba Voss compared to the other ones I've done. Um, not having vision, you're going to be heightened in other senses, and so just being that ultimate warrior of having all these sens senses heightened, um, I never played anything like that before. Mm. Or dad, so that was amazing. Mm -hmm. um, or twenty years older. Yeah, yeah. How do I look? <laughs> how do I look at my gray hair? Beautiful. You like my grays? Listen, man, I, I I really can't wait to watch the rest of the season. Like, I mean that sincerely. Um, I uh, apologize. I have another question for Jason. It's That's just okay. uh, for the. I know there's there's Jesus. the the Collider people and myself are very curious. We're all extremely excited for Dune. Oh, me too. Extremely. Denis, ah, me too. Denis is a genius. Den Denis. He's a genius. Listen, so is Francis, but I'm like, fucking love these two. I'm very, yep. it's been a goddamn great year for me. But uh, Denny, it's gonna be unbelievable. What do you wanna know about Dune? I, nothing that, what can you tell people about it that will not get you in trouble? And uh, do you know when you're filming Aquaman 2? I mean, Aquaman 2 will probably be, I mean, definitely a year plus away. I don't have a set date on that, unfortunately. Uh, what can I say about Dune? Um, <laughs> Denny's, Denny's a genius, and the cast is pretty amazing. I've never seen, uh, well, uh, I can't wait to tell you about stuff. Javier's a badass. Right. I, I, I want to know so much, but I don't want to get you in the, trouble. It's, yeah, I don't want to get in trouble yeah. either. Yeah. But um, I'm very, very excited for all of it. It's been Thank a good year.